Hi, I'm Billy Wickman. Welcome to this episode of The Blast Light. Digital character animation is all about creating memorable and unique characters that are just as complex and three-dimensional as any actor's performance. Vancouver Film School grad Matthew Bilton made this incredibly difficult task look easy in his short film On Guard by creating not one, but two fantastic characters. On Guard is a, a labor of love. You know, it's the film that had been brewing in my head for quite a while. The idea for On Guard started with this sketch I did of this soldier character. He, um, he had this huge moustache, um, the straight hat and just standing very rigid. I thought it would be quite cool to take a character like this, you know, this big moustache, um, and see what I could do to irritate him, to get him out of his formation. So I came up with this idea of having this bird on a wire above him. Um, the bird's name is Weepy. Uh, and uh, <laughs> he was a lot of fun to create. And the story is just about how um, Weepy is irritating Basil, but uh, in essence it's about friendship and forgiveness. Animating a character is more than just sitting in front of a computer. Sometimes the animator must do some acting as well and have fun in the process. I dressed up as a soldier and marched back and forth and got all angry and then I also tried to do a few little birdie hops, not on a wire, but uh, animation is a lot about reference. It's about um, looking at real life, looking at, at drawings, paintings, uh, film uh, and real life situations to draw reference from. So that was invaluable in um, putting the film together. During the six month digital character animation program at VFS, Matthew had to work on a number of different assignments, which only left the last six weeks of the program to work on his film. Well, at the start of the course, I warned Matthew uh, about how difficult the course actually is and how tight the schedule and timeline is. And he stuck to the schedule that he put down and he actually incorporated that time into his film and was uh, very impressed. I was very impressed that he managed to achieve everything that he did. The course that I did, Digital Character Animation, it's a six month course, but it's uh, really intensive. So we, from the start, have to design our own characters, come up with a story, do the storyboards, up until eight weeks to go for the course. Um, you had to have all your assets ready. So the whole film came together in the last six weeks, where we had six weeks to animate and then two weeks to, to render and get it all put together. Watching it progress and seeing that he tied in story, he tied in lighting, he tied in color theory, you really felt the emotion and the mood in his entire film. Although he was a successful videographer and entrepreneur, Matthew left his native South Africa to pursue his dream of becoming an animator. My inspiration comes from just the stories of the pioneers of animation. Animation is bringing things to life, so it really excites me to bring characters to life. I want to quote Disney now and say, he said, all our dreams can come true if we have the courage to pursue them. Pursue your dreams, put as much effort and dedication into it as possible. Um, strive for excellence and see where it takes you because it's quite exciting. I hope you enjoyed meeting Matthew, Basil and Weepy. Please join me again as we showcase the works of other Vancouver Film School students on future episodes of The Blast Light. I'm Billy Wickman. Thanks for watching.